Hi, welcome everyone, and yeah, welcome spring. Spring has sprung. Uh, a couple days ago, uh, the calendar said that spring has arrived. So yeah, it's a beautiful sunny day. I'm going to take the puppies out for a walk in the woods after. Uh, but yeah, it's, I mean, it's the last weekend in March. Anything can happen. Um, I'm sure we'll get one more good snowstorm just... Um, uh, just for effect there but anyway spring has sprung so uh, I did um, I just came back from the Cayman Islands uh, me and Frank went down his uh, friend works down there and uh, his friend owed Frank a favor for some work he did up here so he goes up I'll, I'll pay for your plane tickets come on down and stay with me so we went there for um, about five nights or so so uh, yeah we just came back a couple days ago and I come to the conclusion well many years ago I came to the conclusion I'm just not a hot tropical type of gal uh, I just <laughs> It was so hot and humid, and I mean, it was lovely, but um, yeah, I'm just a cool weather type of person. So anyway, it was a nice time. Uh, so I did come back. I went into withdrawal because shopping in Cayman, either it's souvenir stuff or it's high-end stuff. There's really very little in between. Uh, so I really didn't do a lot of shopping, believe it or not. Um, I did get a little sweatshirt. I did find a yellow purse. Now, I've been looking for a big yellow purse because I love the color yellow. And they're, all the purses up here that are yellow are really, really tiny or they're a really weird yellow color. So I did find one down there. Um, so yeah, it's a decent size. I love my purses. They have to be big. Uh, I cram everything in there, including the kitchen sink. Unfortunately, there's no dividers. I like, uh, because I don't like everything to be jumbled together. But anyway, I'm not, what are you going to do? But yeah, I did finally find a decent sized yellow purse. I did find a couple of pairs of earrings. And that was the first pair. Such pretty little flowers. And then I bought these um, starfish. And I just absolutely love the color of these little starfish. Like a deep, deep coral kind of color. So yeah, that's all I bought in the Caymans, believe it or not. Not much of anything. So um, last year in the fall when I was putting all my pots away, I had these big, wide, long steps uh, in the front. And I just smother the steps with pots. Um, I, I just love the look of all these pots and different flowers and plants and everything. But a lot of them are getting cracked and beat up and they're just looking really, really, really rough. So I went um, last evening to um, HomeSense and I just uh, bought a few pots for this summer. And I also got a few things at Marshall's and uh, there's a new Asian uh, website, it's Canadian, it's located in Calgary, Alberta. And uh, they carry some uh, Korean products, so I did scoop up a few of those. So I will start with uh, some of the spring accessories and decor that um, I purchased at HomeSense last night. And I love bunnies. I had a pet bunny that was litter trained and um, I, I just love bunnies and I love to read. So I found this little rabbit who was reading a book. Um, so yeah, I did have one in the backyard, the ceramic rabbit, but um, the dogs kept knocking him over and his ear broke off and he had a big crack. He's just falling apart. So I thought I'd get a, a new uh, bunny rabbit. And yeah, he's reading a book there. I just love it. Love it. And then I found this... Um, I was going to use it as a candle holder. Uh, and it was on clearance, actually. Um, it was on for $7, so I had a good look at it um, to make sure there's no cracks or anything like that, and it looked good, and I really do love this uh, color, and yeah, for $7, I thought that was a very, very uh, good deal. And then for my plants, um, I found this metal container, it's like a little metal bucket, and had this beautiful floral design on it, and I thought a... Um, big bushy green uh, plant would look really nice in this and um, yeah they had another design and they had uh, other sizes and that in this but uh, yeah I thought a big green plant would look beautiful in that and then for our succulents um, some of them are outgrowing their pots and that so we got this 
little fellow. Jules picked him out. Uh, so we're going to put one of our little succulents in there. And uh, when it's warm enough, we'll move them all outside. But I thought he was so, so cute. And uh, another pot. Um, this one had kind of the terracotta and the... Uh, and then a couple other different colors there. But I thought that was really, really cool. It has these little, these little legs in that. And then this is a mason jar, uh, just a huge, huge mason jar. And I was gonna put a plant in there. Now some of these don't have holes in the bottom for drainage, so I might have to get Frank to get his little power drill out and do some uh, drainage holes for me. But yeah, it looks like a little mason jar. I thought it was really cute. And it's another one for our little succulents, a little striped one. And then I uh, found this one. It's quite large, but it's only $7.99, which is a very good price for this size. And it has a drainage hole in it. And yeah, I thought that was very, very pretty. And I try to stick with like um, red and yellow pots, but sometimes I'll th throw in like a blue or a, a green and that sort of thing. And then this one was, uh, I think this one was made in Spain. I think this was $9.99. It's got a drainage hole. And yeah, the design was so pretty. So yeah, that's it for my, um, my pots. Uh, I'll have to, in the springtime when I put all the pots out on the step, I'll just have to see how many I have in that. So, and then uh, at um, Marshall's, um, or I think this was in Winters. This is a hair store rose water and glycerin. So I did buy the toner. Now what's nice about this is it doesn't have alcohol in it. Um, so it's not uh, drying. So this is classic, classic soothing and pure. Um, so yeah, you just spray it on throughout the day uh, when you're uh, feeling a little bit dry. So I did buy the toner. So I thought I'd try the, the spray. And this is a Makeup Revolution. Um, eyeshadow palette and this is Carmi and he's a youtuber and he uh, uh, does collaborations with um, Makeup Revolution and I love his channel he is just absolutely hilarious I just love him and I thought the colors are really really quite pretty I just love colorful eyeshadow now and it's really, and these are two highlighters, and then you get the, the eyeshadows. And I just absolutely love the colors. And then um, I bought this by Jackie and Lauren Cosmetics. It's these rose highlighters. And I opened it last night, and they're quite messy. They're really messy, actually. Um, so you do get two of them for $7.99, and they look like this. And they actually have... A rose inside so you can see the rose Whoop! yeah it's really messy it just gets everywhere so it's very it's very very shimmery whoops I think they took the idea I think that Yves Saint Laurent had a um, the same idea oh, but it's it's messy let me tell you it's really really messy and then that's the other oh, highlighter I'm just get I'm getting it everywhere. I'm trying to swatch it for you there, but um, yeah, they're definitely. Oh my god, it's everywhere. Yeah, they're definitely very, um, very shimmery. Um, there's almost like little glittery specks in there, so yeah, it could be a little messy. And then this is um, uh, by the Creme Shop, and it's a beauty blender. But so what's nice about this one is it actually stands up. So it does have a flat bottom for it to stand up. And then it's got these, oops, focus there. It's got these um, flatter edges there. So I do actually, ha I do have one of the Creme Shop uh, blenders and I really do like it actually. And then um, I ordered from, from Goryeo, G-O-R-Y-E-O, -E and it's, um, uh, like I said, it was, it's located in Calgary, Alberta. So I did do an online order. It's free shipping over $45. And they did send about... Um, oh! Drop it everywhere! 
they did send about four or five samples. So I'll go over the samples first, if I don't drop everything. And this is the French Egg Cleansing Pack. Uh, so I haven't opened it up yet. So I, uh, I think it's just like a little, uh, it's a bar of soap. I can feel it in there. It's quite quite a good size for a sample. So um, uh, what else did we get here? Uh, there is two of these Korean, oh God, Coriana. Orthia. Um, there's an eye cream and an intensive ampule, which is like a serum. I don't think I've heard of that company. And they did send a sample of a face mask. And I think this one is by Milky Dress. Dress, And it does bubble up. And then they have this uh, Timeless Water Gel Eye Lifting uh, Serum. And I think that's it for the um, the samples. And then I did get from It's Skin the Ye Effector, and it a, has yeast polypeptides in it. <clears throat> and yeah, the yeast kind of um, the fermented yeast kind of helps exfoliate the skin and leaves it quite smooth in that. And then I got this Clean It Zero. Uh, special kit by Vanilla and Company and this is the uh, oil bombs uh, for taking off makeup and I just I just love these oil bombs and uh, yeah I've, uh, I do have the Hymish one which I absolutely love it is just goes like uh, like silk on your skin and just lifts all the makeup off so I thought I'd try this vanilla one um, so they do have uh, four different um, samples in here. This is nourishing, purifying, revitalizing, and the original one. That'll be perfect for uh, traveling. And then I got the Tony Moly Changing Magic Foot Peeling um, Shoes. So uh, I have tried the Esfolio one. Uh, so you put the little booties with essence on in it uh, on your feet for about an hour and a half and a few days later your feet start peeling. So I got those thick thick calluses on my feet so I want my uh, feet to look somewhat pretty in the summertime. And then this is by, oh, who is this by? A O A H C, which stands for Authentic Hydration Cosmetics and it is a collagen set. Uh, so you get a toner emulsion, which is like a lotion, and a serum, and a cream. So I thought I would give that a try. And then this is uh, by, oh, who's this by? Oh, the Face Shop, and it's a blush. And this is in the color Plum Cushion. So you get this cute little puff with it. And uh, you know what? This is very, very light. Um, I thought it was going to be more of a plummy color. So you can just you can put, use this little puff. But yeah, this is it's smooth as butter, but it is really, really light. Like super, super duper light. So I don't think that will really, that may not show up, um, but swatches don't always tell the whole story. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's kind of light. Um, but anyway, that, uh, it came fairly quickly. Uh, so yes, yeah, it's, it's nice to find another Asian cosmetic company. And then uh, I did get a shirt at Marshall's. This is um, by Zara. And it was just this very, very light rose shirt with this paisley design on it. Uh, just nice and flowy. I thought it was really pretty. And then I do love my shawl blankets. Uh, any time of the year um, but a lot of them have patterns and colors on it I just wanted something like a plain white one for the summer and um, I was able to find this in winters so it's just a plain white um, just for those cool summer evenings Woo! so 
that's it. So yeah, I went into a bit of withdrawal from shopping down at Cayman's because there wasn't a lot to shop for. Uh, so when I came home, I went kind of crazy. Um, so anyway, I hope everyone's uh, doing well. I'm going to go have lunch and then uh, just go out and enjoy the beautiful sunny spring day. And uh, everyone take care. Give your loved ones a hug and kiss and we'll see you soon. Bye bye.